weapons. According to the assessment of the national interest, the Islander missile system is one of five Russian most formidable weapons NATO should fear. Missiles of Iskander M are elusive for existing and prospective ABM systems. Managed missiles can be equipped with a nuclear warhead and can fly from the Kaliningrad region to Germany. That is why the NATO is so excited about the planned march of the Iskander in the Russian Baltic region. The Iskander M is a mobile short range ballistic missile system designed to be used in theater level conflicts with an official range of up to 500 kilometers, minimum 50 kilometers. Highly mobile and stealth, it can hardly be detected even with the help of space reconnaissance assets. The accuracy, range, and ability to penetrate defenses allows it to function as an alternative to precision bombing for air forces that cannot expect to launch bombing or cruise missile fire missions reliably in the face of superior enemy fighters and air defenses. Deadly to stationary infrastructure along a broad front of conflict, it is intended to engage small and area targets such as a hostile critical infrastructure facilities, fire weapons, air and anti-missile defense weapons, command posts, and communication nodes, troops in concentration areas, and fixed and rotary wing aircraft at airfields. Jets operating from forward bases will immediately come under threat of attack, or at least immobilization. The Iskander M weighs 4,615 kilograms. Its system is equipped with two solid propellant single-stage guided missiles, which use stealth technology. Each missile in the launch career vehicle can be independently targeted in a matter of seconds. The missile cruises at hypersonic speed of 2100 to 2600 miles a second, MS Mach 6 to 7. The high velocity of the missile allows it to penetrate anti-missile defenses. Flight altitude is up to 6 to 50 kilometers. Interval between launches, less than a minute. The missile can maneuver at different altitudes and trajectories and can turn at up to 20 to 30 G to evade anti-ballistic missiles. It is controlled in all phases of the flight with gas dynamic and aerodynamic control surfaces. Targets can be located not only by satellite and aircraft, but also by conventional intelligence center, by an artillery observer, or from aerial photos scanned into a computer. The missiles can be retargeted during flight in the case of an engaging mobile targets, making it possible to engage mobile targets. The optically guided warhead can also be controlled by encrypted radio transmission, including such as those from AWACS or UAV. The electro-optical guidance system provides a self-homing capability. The missile's onboard computer receives images of the target, then locks onto it with its sight and descends towards it at a supersonic speed. The circular air probable is five to seven meters. Following a relatively flat trajectory, the missile never leaves the atmosphere. False targets and small jammers separate from the rocket upon approaching the target. Iskander M carries a complex of electronic warfare jamming devices, both passive and active, for the suppression of the enemy radar. The missile is extremely difficult to intercept with current missile defense technologies. The Iskander has several conventional warhead options weighing between 480 and 700 kilograms. Depending on type, this includes a high explosive variant, submunison dispenser variant, fuel air explosive variant, a high explosive penetrator variant, or a nuclear payload 50,000 tons of TNT to make it a truly versatile weapon. The system can be transported by any means of transport, including cargo aircraft. It can be operated from temperatures ranging from negative 50 to positive 50 degrees Celsius practically everywhere in the world. In June 2013, it was revealed that Russia had deployed several Iskander M ballistic missile systems in the Armenia at undisclosed locations throughout the country. In 2016, it was reported by media that Armenia had received from the Russian state a division of Iskander missiles. Armenia has become the only country in the world to receive the green light for the purchase of Russia's Iskander M short range ballistic missile systems. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe and thanks for watching.